My name is Marcy Valenzuela. I'm 25 years old and I'm a former foster youth. So I was pretty much born into foster care. I was taken away right after birth because I was born drug addicted. I was in and out of foster care pretty much my whole life. Eventually I entered the juvenile justice system and I emancipated at 18. So growing up like in my early adulthood, um, like 18, 19, um, I only went to the doctors like on an emergency basis and I didn't know that at 18 I had no Medi-Cal. So it's difficult when you have no parents to guide you with this because no one shows you or teaches you where to go or how to get insurance. In 2012, I was diagnosed with rheumatoid arthritis and it really affects my knees. I'm not as active as I used to be when I was younger because of the arthritis. So I've had a cavity for the last two years and I have no medical or dental, so I haven't been able to go to a doctor or dentist. Once I hit 21 and my Medi-Cal was terminated, it seemed like my health went downhill. So I'm going to only have eight months of coverage for free Medi-Cal. I'm super excited because, I mean, I'm going to be able to see a specialist. I'm going to be able to go to a dentist in March. So, like, even though it's a short amount of time, I know I'm really going to use the resources and just get as much as I can from it. So I'm kind of like in this journey to like really organize my life, get me back on track. And it's really starting with my health. And I think having my medical insurance and coverage, it's going to just help me. And like, it's just going to kind of be like a snowball effect. And it's going to just go on into all the areas of my life. So now I really realize how important having medical coverage is. And so I'm working on a project with California Youth Connection. I'm the Affordable Care Act liaison, so I'm helping to get all the former foster youth informed about this new medical like coverage till the age of 26 so that they know and they could take advantage of these opportunities. I think it's going to really help us in our transition into adulthood um, because this is something that we don't really have to worry about so much and so we could focus on other areas of our life.